Welcome to Shomach Shavu on the day of Shir Spanso, Lui Nishma, Sam Yaakov Shom, Le'ab HaSitzchok. We only want Metziyo, Dav Kuf Yud Alef. The Gwana Mudbeis learns from the Pasuk that says, Lo Yisashrik Sochir Oni Ve'evyon. Do you have to be Magdim Oni to the Evyon? Rashi explains what is the difference between an Oni and an Evyon. So he says, Evyon is more poor than the Oni. And Loshin Evyon is a Oive Ve'enu Masik Mashinaf Shem Misavo. He wants something, but he can't get it. And the Gemara goes on to say that there's a difference between an Oni and an Evyon because an Oni is embarrassed to ask, but an Evyon is not embarrassed to ask. And to explain this a little bit more, I am in the Bira Gro on Mishli. Two Gros in Mishli. One is the Gro on Mishli Perik Lamed Posukudat. To there, the Gro explains what's the difference between an Oni and an Evyon. Oni is someone who was rich and he lost his money. And we're trying to help him out to keep his house. He has assets, but he's about to lose everything. So you're trying to help him out to keep his status, to keep what he's holding on to. So at this moment, he's not missing anything. But he's about to lose everything and therefore you need to help him. But a Evyon is someone who doesn't have anything. He never had it to lose it. He just, his misavit to have these things that he never had. So based on this grow, we understand better why an Oni is embarrassed to ask and Evan is not. Because an Oni is someone who had everything and he lost it. He really belongs with Ashirim. He belongs with the rich people. That's his status. He now is trying to hold on to what he has. He's very embarrassed in his situation. But Evan never had. He just has a type to have something he never had. So he's not embarrassed to ask. And this leads us to the next Vilna Goyen on Mishli Perek Lamed Aleph Posuk Chof. Perek Lamed Aleph is the famous Eish Yishchayel Mi'imtzo. Kedua, that Perek is speaking about Torah. And Eish Yishchayel we say, Kapo Porso Leoni Ve'yodeyo Shilcho Lo'evyon. Says the Vilna Goyen Dover Niflo Mo'it. What does it mean, Porso Leoni Ve'shilcho Lo'evyon? What's the difference? So he says, Oni and Evyon over here, we talk about Oni and Evyon in Torah. The Evyon is someone who's running for Bisrendish to Bisrendish and is asking to learn. He's not embarrassed to ask. But the Oni is someone who's sitting at home and he's hoping to understand Torah. But he's embarrassed to ask other people to help him to learn. And that we know, Someone who's embarrassed will never learn. You cannot be embarrassed to ask. So someone who asks is not embarrassed. He's the Evyon, Evyon in Torah. He will get Torah Meloi Shefa. Someone who's an Oni, who is embarrassed to ask, he doesn't learn as well. It says the Vilna Goyen, that's the Pshat in the Pasuk. Kapo porcelioni. Kapo means a closed hand. There is given to an oni, but it's a closed hand. It's not an open hand. Also, that's the word porcel. Porcel means it's being sent to him. It's something which is being sent later. It doesn't happen right away. It's not a lot of shefa of time. But by the heaven it says, Yodeyo shil cholevyon. Yodeyo means open hands. Precede the You have an open hand, Meloi Shefa, and shil being given right away, without any delays. One who's an Oni is embarrassed to learn, he's going to get some Torah, but not at the same level of someone who's an Evyon, who's Toev, he's asking, requesting, and begging and yearning to learn Torah. He will get Torah, Meloi Shefa. In Abash and Lamed, someone who's not embarrassed will be able to learn Torah with no limitations. Anyone who wants to join Shomach Shava, email us to WhatsApp, please email Shomach at gmail.com.